This is a repair for the Dorma ES-112B Fail Secure and ES-112B Fail Safe electric strike. For this repair, you will need a number one Phillips screwdriver, a 50 thousandths hex wrench, and a DOR-001 replacement spring. The DOR-001 replacement spring can only be purchased by calling Sandfly Locksmith at 912-354-KEYS. That's 912-354-5397. The strike has an issue where the spring is broken inside and the gate opens. It's kind of hard to show with the cover on, but um, because of the solenoid not released at this point. We start by using a number one Phillips screwdriver to take out the four screws from the cover. There's two screws on the top, a screw on each end. Then very carefully remove the cover. It's locked in right there. It has a lip right there that's, that's caught on that. So you have to get it up over the lip. Then work it off of the wires. Set the cover aside. Now you'd be able to tell what's going on. With this particular model, this is the ES-112B fail secure model. So normally this is latched. Whenever you push in on the solenoid, then that should have a spring operating that right there. The spring right here is broken. And what we're doing is replacing that spring. In order to replace this spring, the spring should have two legs on it. And here you see it only has one. So this spring here is broken. To remove the spring, we use a 50 thousandths hex wrench. And there is one screw retaining there. So there's two screw holes. But in general, you will find that there is a hex set screw in the opposite end from the solenoid. So it could possibly be in this end, but it, it's generally in this end. You loosen this screw about four turns. You don't need to remove it entirely. It actually fits in a slot in the, in the shaft. So once you turn it about four turns, then you can use your number one screwdriver to push on the end of the shaft and actually push it back so that it just clears the spring. It doesn't need to go any further than that because what you're doing is actually just removing this spring right here. It would help me if I had tweezers here. But anyway, so you're removing this broken spring and replacing it with a good spring. Putting this spring in, it has, the springs have a short leg and a long leg. You want the long leg facing toward the solenoid. All right, once you get the spring in place, then you have to press down on the spring and shove the shaft back through the spring. There is a little difficulty here sometimes lining the shaft up with this hole here. You just have to manipulate it some, and it will go into place. All of this kind of floats here. It really does go into place. Now it's in place. Okay, now line up the shaft 
flush on this end. Tighten the set screw up. Do not over tighten the set screw. Don't, uh, don't ruin it for the next time for the repair. That probably should be enough right there. All right, now to test this particular model, the fail secure model, which normally is locked, you can press in on the solenoid and pull down on the gate. And you'll see now that it goes back to the, to the locked position or the latch position okay that's the repair part of it now it's just putting the cover back on and then putting the cover back on you want to make sure that you don't pinch the wires that you get the wires back through the slot in the side and then just put the four 440 by 3 16 flat head screws back in to put the cover back on. It appears that that screw is already stripped. And that completes the repair. Of course, now it doesn't come out anymore because it needs voltage on it for it to come out. But that completes the repair of the model ES112B Dorma electric strike.